first thing to think about is this ordering or is it grouping? Ordering questions, you're just putting um, a larger group of people into subgroups. So for instance, let's say you've got four people and you want to choose three of them. You're making different groups of three. These are all different groups. It, it wouldn't be different to say that there's a group CBA because CBA and ABC are the same. That's grouping. You're making a subgroup or a subset of a larger pool. Ordering, you could use the same example of ABCD. Let's say we want to make a, a three-digit, uh, three-letter code. Well, if it's a code, the order matters. And so this ABC thing can be done a, a whole bunch of different ways. Not that there aren't other codes that we can make with D and, and, and the other letters. But just breaking down... ABC, that can go a whole bunch of different ways. So the big difference between grouping, what we have over here, and ordering over here, is that with ordering, it matters where things are placed. With grouping, it doesn't. In our question, we're making a committee. And so we're choosing three people from eight. And that sounds a lot like grouping, because it doesn't matter where people are standing. And for instance, a group of Kate, Al, and um, Bill is not different than a group of Bill, Al, and Kate. It doesn't matter that I put Bill over here. That's the same group. So there's no ordering element to this. The easiest way I think of approaching these is to think about how what the subdivision is going to be. In this case, we need to make a group of three and think about how many people you're choosing from, and that's eight. And you take that group, and that dictates how many slots you have, and you go ahead and number those slots. You start at one, and you ascend. And then you take the pool, and you put it in here, and you descend. Here, though, we have a small constraint that you can't have married people on the same, um, on the same team. So the first slot, we can put in whomever. doesn't matter. Totally open. But when we get to the second slot, not only are we losing the person from the first slot, we're also losing their partner, so you're down to six. Same thing ha happens for the third one. You lose this one, you lose this one, and you lose both their partners, so you're down to four. Then you have to divide. Last step, you multiply. You might be wondering why you're dividing. That's because the ordering doesn't matter with groups. And by dividing, you're taking out those extra groups. So by dividing, you're eliminating CBA and BCA. Those are getting eliminated by this division. 